Lord Farron, what the hell? I thought you were dead. Worried about me? Oh, you do care. I've learned the ways of the jungle, Jasmina. Conquered its dangers. I'm a new man. You've only been gone a few hours, Farron. When I heard Master Bongo's airship went down, I immediately set out to find him. He has to finish training me. Dear gods, the last time I trained you, I lost an eye. I can't afford to lose another. If you want to make yourself useful, repair our defenses. We won't survive the night without them. Help us collect scrap material from the cave. We need it to arm our camp. I think this is actually Crispin Freeman. God, I hear that voice actor everywhere I go. I either want to watch an, a certain anime or I want to play games. It's oh, Crispin Freeman is like everywhere. Don't get me wrong, Crispin Freeman is fantastic. It's just... He is everywhere. Oh my god. That's a focus? What kind of focus is that? That's a healing power focus. Okay. Alright. And more crafting material. Good. More savage stuff. You know what? I got this mystic savage kit. Which is going to be fantastic when it comes to me putting together or putting apart things that I have. But I don't really need. Hmm. What else can I pull apart here? Got some plenty of luck. There we go. More luck. What else I got here? A bunch of crafting material. Don't need that. More luck. More crafting material as well. And I think that's about it. I can't really do anything else here. Yeah, I can't really do much at this point. Alright, let's go inside the cave here and see if we can collect some parts. Yeah, whatever savage, scrap, anything that could help us out. There's also a mastery now that I probably should obtain as soon as possible. So let's go ahead and get this thing. Whoa! Hello. Hi, this place is quite something. There's a frog there, Scout Bundy. Hey, Bundy. Hey, buddy. Hey, I've been here before, didn't I? I think I've been here before. The Scout Mundy. Not sure what he is doing here, but Scout Mundy just being Scout Mundy. I think I gotta use this. Yeah, it took me somewhere. Oh, hello. There's my mastery. Let's go and collect this. Nice! Now, testament to my greatness, exactly, Colette. We are great, and everybody should know about it. <laughs> That's still not cynical, right? No, not, you know, egotistical. Let's take this with me, there we go. Uh, I can grab the scrap over here, though. Let's get this. Uh, what else can I get here? I'm not gonna... I'm not jumping down to deal with the mushrooms, hell no. <laughs> yeah, I'll be the last person to deal with that. Okay, now, how do we... What do we do here? I think we glide around like this and come back and give it to the guy, I think. Scrap metal received 5 out of 50. We gotta collect tons of scrap metal here. Nobody's doing any of it. <laughs> there we go. Savage some items for you. Well, I think we got maybe like 3 or something. What have we got here? More satchels with more stuff. Do I know what good use for this? I don't think so. Well, good, a good use is like taking a part and just convert it to crafting material. <laughs> That's a decent use for it, right? Got a point of interest here. Oh, nice! We got a point of interest here. I need a couple more around the place to see if I can... Need two more. One over here, which I discovered, and one over here. Hmm. Oh, there's a lot of things happening down there. I don't know. I don't even know if I want to get in there. Eesh. Lots of mushrooms and somebody died. I'm so sorry, buddy. I If I knew that mushrooms were attacking you, I would have came immediately. <laughs> I didn't realize that you needed help. You went down faster than ever. Oh my god, I feel so bad about it now. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go around this way. And I'm gonna glide around to a little safe area. A little safe nuke here. That's what I'm gonna do. Thank you. I'll take the scrap. I'll take this scrap over here. I don't get many scraps really around the place, but... I mean, I'll take what I can get, right? Let's go up here back to the mastery. From there, I can glide around back to the general and be like, Hey, I know it's not a lot, but at least I'm away from all the mushrooms. After recording, if you want to discuss stuff like the new raid tier, then I'll be around. Sounds good. It just, I honestly cannot do it right now at the moment. It's just, like, literally, I'm recording this right now, but I've got a class afterwards. Hmm. Where can I go from here, though? Maybe I can go over here and discover this. Yeah, you know what? Let's go do this. Let's at least complete the map. That's the least we could do for now. I can do all the events later. You know, I mean, the, the events of events. You know, somebody will come around and take my place. I'm pretty sure. And if they don't, then I guess another event will unlock. Usually that's kind of what ends up happening. But other than that, 
We should probably go over here, at least discover the event. Maybe do this little zone. Not sure what it's there for, but we'll try to get around to it. Uh, I could find a dog, but I could also go around the dog. Kind of want to go around the dog, though. Let's go around this. Can I not jump up here? Oh, there we go. Now I can. Smoke scale? Oh, I'd really rather deal. Not even deal with those guys. Ish. Uh, smoke scale. Oh, God. 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 Ish. Uh, don't want to deal with smoke scale. <laughs> if possible. Although, if I, if I deal with him, I'd rather go ahead and do this here. There we go. Oh, God. Back away. Can I suck him in? Or suck him out? I can't. So with smoke scale, the problem is is that he creates an AoE field where he doesn't get hurt whatsoever, but we are still we, we still can get harmed. Which is literally smoke scales are like one of the worst things to ever like fight with on this map. They're the most unfair enemies I've ever had to displeasure of dealing with. There we go. And hopefully I don't have to fight him again in the future. That's about it. What will this portal take me to? Let me check over here. Pit exit. Let's take the pit exit and we go with a bunch of beetles. Beetles don't seem to care about stuff, so... I think, okay, there's a giant spotted beetle coming in my way. I probably should run away from it. Just in case. Eesh. I don't want to deal with that spotted beetle, though. Hmm, maybe I could fight it a little bit. Oh, somebody's fighting it. Probably could fight it a bit. Yeah, I guess I could fight it. Why not? Help out the person. And maybe not get hurt like this. Let's see what we can do here. Some of my clone army. Come on, clones. Let's do this, guys. Let's go and bully this enemy to submission. Oh god, back away. There we go. Oh, no, I'm getting a little hurt there. Oh, back. Oh, there we go. That's how we do it. And we finish off the beetle. Excuse me, Mr. Beetle. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the airship cargo if you don't mind. There we go. And I need one more point of interest. I think it's actually over here somewhere. I think what I can do is actually... Hmm, I gotta get up here. How do we get up here to Vibrant Cliffs? I think go to Jacket It's a Waypoint and like fly over there. Let me try doing that. Let me try doing that. Let me see if that will help me get across to there. And wow, this place is downloaded. I don't know what it is with Heart of Thorns, but whenever I go from one, like, you know, from one place to another and it's, like, quite a long load, things unload at first. And it's not something with my hard drive, I know that for sure. My hard drive is actually top-notch, and my antivirus software does not interfere with any of my games. I made sure, double-check, made sure to mark it so that my antivirus software does not even detect any of the games as, like, you know, kind of, like, odd files, let's just say that. So it doesn't, it shouldn't do that technically. Although it is still a possibility, maybe it's something on my end. I mean, still, not gonna rule out the, you know, possibilities. But as far as I think it may be something with the game, I don't know. A lot of people that also play the game report to me that they have been have also having odd loading issues every now and then. It's not a big deal, but it's just like, it's, I'd rather not have the like weird, you know, soup pixel, when if, if possible. <laughs> but otherwise, otherwise it's, uh, it's not too bad. Let's go around and get this last point of interest. The hell is who the hell is making those noises? <laughs> what the hell? I just see it just like burr, burr. I'm like, what the hell is going on here? It's a little freaky. Can you please stop? Oh, I remember this event. Yeah, Lord C Utogi. We gotta get some vibrant eggs for him. And if you get vibrant eggs, that lets us get uh do the event where we kill a vibrant. That's what we can do. Let me see if I can get up here like this. Hello there, it's a scout. Hey, buddy. Use the shrooms again. I'm trying to figure out a way to get over to the waypoint, as well as maybe try to save the Coltic Necro over there. Hmm. Let me try to see if I can save him a little bit. Oh, Jesus. Coltic Necro, I'm coming for you, bud. I'm coming for you. Don't worry. I'm going to be there in a bit. I'll try to save you here. Yeah, there we go. We can probably help you out. One of, my, one of my clones is helping out on the side. There we go. And that's how you help out a person in need, boys and girls. That's exactly how you help out a person in need. Is it upstairs? Oh, don't tell me I gotta go even higher. Ugh. <laughs> well, I guess I got, I'm gonna have to go even higher for this waypoint. Is there like a 
a thing I can travel to up there? No, it's not. Jesus, how do I get up there? <laughs> how does one get up there? Maybe, like, I can go through these trees and stuff. Maybe that will let me... I don't actually, I actually have no clue. <laughs> how do I get up there? There gotta be some way for me to get up there, though. Just need to find it. I need to find some secret ways of getting up there again. I see gusts of wind. I just don't remember how to get to them anymore. I could probably come back to that wreckage over there, but otherwise I don't know where else I can go through here. Try maybe jump around like this, see if that can give me like a gust of wind or something. See, I just need one little gust of wind and I can usually find a chain of things to kind of follow through with it. Hmm, nothing over here. Let me go scroll down over here. I don't know for some reason why scrolling around also affects my chat, but... Hmm. It's gotta be a way for me to get up there though. Without too much of a hassle. There's some, I mean, there's gonna be obviously some hassle involved, but not too much of a hassle would be nice. Probably get out around like that and see if I can climb the tree. Maybe. Possibly. Maybe not. Hmm. It is a conundrum. When you when you go over to Heart of Thorns, it is a conundrum to kind of figure out how to, you know, go up and down different elevations of places. It is a. It's something you learn just by running around and practicing, but at first, when you first enter Heart of Thorns, it's very confusing because you don't, you know, you don't have any of the gusts of wind abilities and your mushroom abilities, and you kind of have to learn by trial and error. And usually, it's more error than trial or anything else. I'm trying to find a decent gust of wind. There's no like spot on, like oh, here you go. This is how you get up, kind of gust of wind area. Kind of have to run around for a bit until you learn until you kind of like find certain locations i know there are probably some shortcuts out there i'm just not an expert in them at least not yet <laughs> i don't play this game that much to become an expert in this game hello wasp you really want to mess with me and nope he ends up bullying another player completely <laughs> we end up fighting a wasp and he ends up bullying another player completely there we go i think if i go across like this i might be able to find like a gust of wind i just need a small little gust of wind to show me the way show me the way up and that's all I need. After I figure out a way up, then I can probably find ways of traveling on my own. Maybe there's like a gust of wind on the side here? No, there's not. Floor is lava, I don't want to deal with that. And let's go over here. I think there might be... See, I just need one little point of interest and I'm gonna have to go through the... <laughs> go through the trouble of finding the gust of wind all over again. Just to, uh, Just to go back down. <laughs> oh god, this is so messed up. I, I'm literally going up and down, up and down, and all I need is just a small little boost to get, you know, one little, one little waypoint, or point of interest, and now I gotta go all the way back around to try to find again. Oh, that's gonna kinda suck a little bit, but you know what, it's whatever, it's part of the adventure, we can at least complete the map for today, and uh, see if we can, can find a way to just have map completed status on there. <laughs> Let's get around the bugs, don't wanna deal with them, little bugsies. I know you guys, you know, want to be, you know, do your bug thing, and you, you know, want to do your bug stuff, but no, I'm not a fan of it. You do your thing, I do my thing. It'll be all good. Oh, there we go. I found us some, some small chain of gusts I could probably take. I'll go right here and take this gust over here. Oh, God. There we go. Then we can go fly over to this gust of wind, and that should technically take us over to go up, and we can find a point of interest. Let's do this here. Let's get around like this, get like a little running start, and up, up we go. And what do we go now? I think we go this way. <laughs> Alright, well I think I can go right here, right? Yeah, I can land on the wing. I think it's a wing, I'm not sure actually. For some reason I see this giant aircraft thing as like a bug of a sort. I'm not sure if I'm correct here in its design, but it kind of looks like a bug to me at first. Now where's a point of interest at again? It's, uh, where'd you go, point of interest? Where'd you go? It's all the way there. Hmm, so we gotta figure out a way to go up like this and just kind of travel around. The first thing I gotta do is catch a gust of wind so I can actually travel places. I don't think there's a gust of wind over there, although I could be wrong. Maybe there was a gust of wind. <laughs> I have to relearn how to use these gusts of wind again. Hmm. Let's go back to the original vine that I had over there, right? There was a vine right there on the left that I could get over to. 
I could travel up there. Oh, there's a gust of wind over there. Probably try to take that. Take a chain of gusts of wind to kind of travel around the place. There we go, nice and easy. It's not lagging, thank god. There's a lovely strong box from Ferenc Flyers. Hello there, strong box of Ferenc Flyers. Let me check what you got here. There's a rabbit up here, guys. Rabbit, you probably should not be up here, buddy. This is the last place you want to be at. You, I'm, I feel so bad for you, buddy. I don't know how the hell you got up here, but you probably should find a way to get down. This is not a place for rabbits to be at. <laughs> I'm not even kidding you, friend. You might want to leave as soon as possible. There's a rabbit on here. Like, out of all things, you find a freaking rabbit. <laughs> Alright, that's cool. That's great. Let's see, if there's a way to get around like this. There should be a way for us to get up here. Or at least I would think so. Hmm. There we go. Oh, nice and easy. There's a chain of gusts of wind that I can take there, but I can also go all the way up here and figure out a way, a faster way to get to the waypoint. Hello. This is usually a boss area. I've done this boss before. Hello, Toucan. A tropical bird. Uh, but it's not the best boss out there to really battle. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to avoid it this time around. I think I can go over this way to the next chain of islands. Maybe take this gust of wind network, if that will take me anywhere. Let's see if I can catch this gust of wind. Come on. Come on, catch me, catch me, catch me. <laughs> there we go. Oh, sweet. Oh my god, we are all the way up in the air. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this is a little scary. I think I'm going the right way. Yeah, I should be going like this and then kind of making my way upwards, right? Where's this place at? It's all the way there. Near the side, huh? Let's see if you can get close to this gust of wind here. Come on. Catch me, catch me, catch me, catch me! Restore my flying powers. Just a little more, come on, hey, oh god. Oh god, thank god, thank god, oh Jesus, thank god. <laughs> thank you, thank you, gusts of wind. Couple more networks of wind over here. It's kind of difficult to tell where the wind is at from up here because it's so cloudy and stuff. But otherwise it shouldn't be too difficult. Come on, catch me, catch me, catch me. Catch me, thank you. Let's get over here. I think we just gotta keep flying to the right to find this thing. Yep, couple of islands, couple of little destruction islands that we gotta catch over here. Come on, gust of wind. Oh god, no, oh no, oh no. Oh dear, oh jeez, oh lord, oh lord. Catch me, catch me, wind, catch me! Thank you. Oh god, <laughs> that was terrifying. Can we go through here? Oh, there's another chain of wind over here that we can take. And we go down, we go here. Right? Yeah, we can go over here. That will refill our wind bar. Now we can go to this big gust of wind. I think we're getting close to this point of interest here. Yep, we should be getting close to it. Very, very close to it. I just gotta figure out if it's up or down. <laughs> okay, now we're up or down here on this car point of on this car point of interest. You're very interesting to me. Even though you have been undiscovered yet, you're very, very interesting to me. Can I just... I think I can probably rest for a little bit and then guide over. I think it's somewhere over there. I believe so. I don't know, it's kind of it's kind of difficult to tell sometimes. How far away it is and everything. It is there for sure. It says it's over here, but I, when I got close to it, it said I was still kind of far away from it. Maybe I can use this chain of wind right here, catch this wind, and I'll fly to the left, see if I can get to it. Let's try that. Now that the wind bars are filled. Oh, hello! Caught another gust of wind here. Wow, that's, uh... Quite a gust. Quite a gust. <laughs> Alright, it's definitely below us, that's for sure. Okay, I'm getting close to it, let's just pull it down for a bit. Let's see if we can glide over here at least. I think it's maybe this place here that I gotta f discover. And I got the last discovery place. Oh, look at this! A haunted map completion on this place. And we got a mesmer cache as well. What do we have here? Oh, look at all this goodies. It's too many goodies for me to even see here. First of all, anything we can take apart. We can take apart the gun. Put in your resources and luck. I'll take that. We got Gift of the Fleet. In Mystic Forge, combine a gift of fleet, a gift of Tario, a gift of Chalk, a gift of jungle to create a gift of Maguma, used for crafting legendary weapons. Alright, well, we'll definitely put that away over here, just in case. And Mesmer Cash. What did Mesmer Cash give me? 
<laughs> what did I just get? What did we just get? Layer, uh, we got pants. We got pants of power and frosty. Oh, these are actually way better pants. <gasps> oh, baby. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's that, that's exactly what we need. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's way better pants. Serious pants. And the Berserkers, which is great. That's what we need. Oh, baby. That was actually really cool. That was actually worthwhile grab. That was perfect. All right. Well, let's go ahead and go to a place that's a little bit less crazy around here. <laughs> Alright, so uh, we discovered the entire Verdant Brink. I think this place is called Verdant Brink. Yeah, Verdant Brink. Right here. It just says right over here. We got the entire discovery of Verdant Brink. Got all the things discovered. Got We did some events out there. That were actually pretty fun. Uh, did a lot of exploration. Pretty much completed full exploring this place. You know, now that I got... Uh, now that I actually experienced most of this place, I actually feel a lot more comfortable here. Compared to when I first tried to rush through this place. I'm finally getting used to this map. And I think it's actually one of my favorite maps so far. Probably because I just know it best. Next map for me to explore is going to be right over here, Auric Basin. And I think this place actually gets locked out at certain points because I, you know, because of the events and, you know, to do certain events, you need to do certain things out there, participate in timed events, and if the events are failed or something, it like locks it out or something. As, as cool as it would be, I'd rather see if maybe I can get on like the more populated, or more like a I guess populated day or populated time zone or something and uh, see if I can do the events. But anyway, guys, I nevertheless hope you enjoyed still. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video. And we got also another reward here, just like that. Hello. <laughs> Let's get rewards left and right. I'm not, I'm not even doing anything. I'm just literally standing here just receiving rewards. Let's see. What can we take apart over here? Oh, pedal. Carry-ons. No, we don't need that. We can easily take that apart. Let's see. Take this apart. There we go. Got some... Can we take this apart? Oh, we can. Can't we? There we go. Take all this. And put away all this stuff. And I got a bunch of junk that I'm going to have to sell sometime else. Or some other time. But anyway, guys. I'll let you know, Hope you enjoyed. My name is Samriel. Like, subscribe. And as always, have a great day. See ya.